Okay, mid-level blends are where the auto companies are talking right now. There is a very concerted effort to get a high octane fuel into the fuel supply. And let's just, for right now, let's just call it E30, a 30% ethanol blend offers, and let's, I'll round this off, and let's say it's 95 octane fuel. Car manufacturers have done about all they can on 87 octane, right? The engines are about as good as they're gonna get on 87 octane. They need a higher octane fuel to jump on a new technology S-curve so they can get more power, more mileage, less emissions, and meet very stringent future CAFE standards. So they're asking for a mid-level ethanol blend. It's the best performing fuel, it's the lowest cost fuel, and it is uh, the best performing fuel. Maybe I mentioned that. But anyway, that's why we're going to a mid-level ethanol blend in this country. E10 now, E15 is a step change to allow us to grow, and E30 is, let's just call it the 10-year plan, so that auto manufacturers can meet CAFE standards.